In this sports design video, we're going to learn how to make this Instagram post for the Miami Dolphins. This is a simple beginner level design, but you can definitely learn some tips and tricks if this is not your first time on Photoshop. So stick around and don't miss a thing. All right, the first thing I'm going to show you guys is how to do this background. So if you look at the top right hand corner, you can see that the Dolphins have the player in the background centered and squared off. It's important to note that I have two layers here. One layer is the background layer and the other is the player layer where he's already masked out of. Now, if you look at the picture that I'm using, I have a fan in the background that ruins the entire picture. So what you can do is you can take your lasso tool and you can select the person or object you want to get rid of. And then once you have it selected, you can hit control click on the selection and scroll down to fill. And we're going to fill content aware. If it doesn't completely cut out your subject, you can always fill it content aware a second time. In this case, I'm going to use the marquee tool to cut out the parts of the background to match the dolphins post so it won't matter too much, but it's a useful tip that you guys can add to your bag of Photoshop tricks. If you guys are enjoying today's video, drop a like it's free and it helps my channel out more than you guys know. As always, if it hits 100 likes, I'll drop the PSD file in my next video. Next, we're going to quickly retouch our player in Camera Raw Filter. If you want to see my specific adjustments, you can always pause this part of the video, but I want to place a strong emphasis on noise reduction in this particular graphic, and this can be found in the Detail tab. This makes my player's skin look a little bit better, a little bit smoother, and it gives it a professional look. I also made some adjustments to the background layer just to add some texture and clarity as well as some sharpening to clear up my image. If you look at the top right hand corner, the dolphins made the background green over a picture. This process is really simple and is a great effect for anyone that's just starting out in design. So above your background layer, you're going to add a new adjustment layer called a color fill. What this will do is put a solid color over your entire image. And then what you can do is reduce the opacity to give that effect that the dolphins have. All right, step six is how to make your text look better. So listen, with social media, you wanna make sure your graphics are really easily readable. So oftentimes graphic designers will spread out their text to make it just easier for the reader to view it. So you can do this by highlighting your text, going up to window and then going to character. And then we're going to adjust this tab right here. The larger the amount you put in, the more spread out your text is going to be. All right, this part is what really makes your graphics stand out. It's your main text. So I have two text layers here. I have the first text layer at the fill opacity of zero. And then I have a stroke on that so that it outlines my player's name. And then for the text underneath, it's simply a regular text layer with the fill opacity lowered. I also added the rectangle that they have in the bottom right hand corner. And that's just an additional add on. And after you've done that, you should have something like this. If you enjoyed today's video, please check out some of my other videos. I actually have a very similar video to this one where I break down a professional team social media post. If you guys wanted to check that out, you can click right here. Thank you all so much for watching and I'll see you soon.